Hi friends, it's Saturday, September 13th, 2014. Lynn and Jamie continuing our assignment. Today we're driving from DC to Florida with a Prius packed full of stuff. In asking for our instructions for the session today, it is to uh, for Jamie to facilitate a healing session with me as the physical barometer. And the intentions for this session are to heal the root causes of the feelings of pressure in the right foot, from the arch of the foot up into the right calf, up to the arch of the calf, from arch to arch, and whatever they represent in such a way as to align with the soul plan and trigger the awakening whose time has come. And also to address the root causes of the sleep disturbances these past several days. And to heal the root causes of them and whatever they represent in such a way as to trigger the awakening whose time has come. And with that, we begin. Reaching up to the guides of the universe. Wow, it's like, I don't think I've ever seen guides like that. What do you mean? There, it's like, um, it's all, all inspiring doesn't cover it. It's like re breathtaking. They're so wonderful. They're so wonderful. They're so wonderful. You know the big dark fingers that we see on the yes. map of the United States? I yes. see them on the universe. Yeah. Oh, Huge. wow. Do you see them? Yes. Huge. Like huge dark coming down. And it, I, they're showing me the universe kind of like a globe so that I can understand it. Yes. And it's like the fingers coming around yes. the globe. It looks yes. like those chocolate oranges when you split them and they come yes. into parts. Yes. I see through it. the universe, huge. Segmenting the segmenting, universe. Segmenting, segmenting. With space in between. The light points are really beautiful. They feel really good. They feel... They do. Healthy. Healthy and bright and sac sacred. Yes, they're living their soul plan. Right. But they're choosing by and large an attitude of yes I will rather than no I won't. We were having a conversation today about roots, about rooting plants and when you put plants in water, just water, they have weak roots. Fragile Fragile roots. roots. And I felt like without the future energy, these lines had fragile roots. And when we draw in future energy, it's like they can grow strong. Grow strong stabilize. What I see is someone who's moving the stars around. Like, yes, I see that. Like they're conducting the movement of the stars. I see that. And they nod when I say conducting the movement of the stars. Yes. It's like directing the divine wind. Right. It's like they move their hands and the and wind blows. everything moves. It, it looks like big things. Big clouds that are way on too strings. heavy to be on, on strings. Right, big clouds That's on small. strings and the clouds move and the strings just break. I'm seeing a lot of them and they're in the dark areas. They the dark areas seem to be predominantly these untethered clouds. They look like big clouds of what looks like galaxies but it's like many many in each cloud. Yes. How does this tie into the symptoms? Well, they're showing... <laughs> well, what they were just showing is the clouds all of a sudden had feet. Little I feet. I love that. Uh, you know the children who have the things on the wrist and there's like little ties to their moms and the mom has a thing on the wrist? Yes. They're showing those, but the clouds cut the cut them they took them off and yes. they went Foom! they did it on yes. purpose yes. they did it on purpose they took it off yeah it wasn't too weak or thin to hold them they took it off they took it off yeah and then they floated 
and it feels like the floating is different. Some of them seem to intentionally steer for the dark areas and others seem to just be confused and like follow others or just like bumble into it. Follow the wrong current. Right. And I see the big hands that are swishing, but it's like the they just go over like it isn't it's an eddy. Yeah, it's an eddy. The ankle ties like tiny diamonds, diamond chain, unbreakable chain. The unbreakable diamond chain. And I see now people sawing at their leg, trying to saw their foot off so the chain will come off. Sawing their foot off, I see lots and lots of feet. It's like a pile of I see sawed the pile off of feet. feet. I see that pile of feet. And we'd rather cut our feet off. Yeah. We'd rather cut our feet off than live our soul plan. It doesn't feel like you'd rather cut off your foot than live your soul plan. But it feels like a lot of people would. A lot of people would. I'd rather cut off their feet. And instead of they're damning the chain, they're saying the chain is the problem. Yes. The chain is the problem. Right. Uh, when the chain is connected, it's the diamond chain is connected to light. Yes. It's destined to pull them forward right. into their own destiny. I'm seeing now a clock, a really fast moving clock, like the hands are just moved like a blur. And it feels like the chains used to be, it was like kite strings, little tugs, and now it's like, boom, it's like pulling in a fishing line. Yeah. Pulling in a fishing line, and lots of people are feeling the, whoa, pulling fishing line, and most of them seem to just go for Freak the saw. Out. Right. Or try and chew their legs off. Yes, I see people gnawing their gnawing legs off. Gnawing their legs off. Their own legs. And some of them are being, <laughs> I think I'm in this category, some of them are being dragged along, but instead of running, they're just bumping on the <laughs> road. So they're moving forward, but you could be doing it in a way that is much more pleasant for you and much more effective for everybody. You see those people? It's like yes, they're I being do. dragged along. Boom, 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 boom. It's a choice. You could run. You could skip. You could scooter. You could do lots Take of things. Take a Vespa. Bicycle. Or you could be dragged like or that. Or you could be dragged like that. So It probably doesn't does feel this, very good. Yeah. How does this relate to this symptom? The galaxy is trying to gnaw off her, her foot. foot. She... Something has snapped. Something snapped. I can Cause feel I the see, snap. Because I see going along, she's walking, she's walking, and then something snaps. And she drops, drops down, down and starts gnawing on her yes, leg. Yes, I see that. What I'm being shown is that um, woman in the correctional facility who is so chock so full of entities. So full of entities. <gasps> hit critical mass yes so she fill was filling and couldn't it couldn't process clear fast enough and it's like a ship taking on water right as I was coming up it felt like I was moving through soil yes and I was seeing roots pass and I kept bursting up through soil into light and then through new soil and up into light and then new soil and up into light and then new soil. Yes. Through layers and layers and layers and layers. And it looked like every time it was like it would burst through the earth and be a tiny plant and then grow really fast into a tree and then into new soil. And grow into a tiny plant to a big tree and then new soil. Cycles of incarnation. Oh, those uh, shriveled plants that couldn't grow because they had built the houses around themselves and they were living in the houses, but they were supposed to be trees and then burst through and be little plants again, and then trees and then burst through and be little plants again. And they s shut it down, seeing again the roots, and they're showing what looks like a chain of trees, like the roots of one tree grow into the branches of the other. The branches become the roots. Yeah. Become the branches, become the roots. Yeah. And now it looks like the trees are gnawing at their branches. It looks like the Snow White trees or the Wizard yes. of Oz trees that are alive and they move. Yes. 
Yeah. It was like they showed me this beautiful chain of roots to branches to roots to branches that all of a sudden they started gnawing on themselves and now it's like the trees are, like the branches are getting gnawed and so they're not connecting anymore and it looks like trunks and like chewed up bits of branch kind of floating. Self-sabotage. Self-sabotage. Entities. Entities. Huge entities. And it looks like they're made of many entities that have like, uh, like Rat King. Yes. They've all fused together. Yes. To create huge, it's like these dark masses. It's like, huge. it's like the rescue spirits came in and the entity blobs blew apart and created these huge, massive clouds. It's huge. It looks like like those paintings of, of devils and angels fighting. Yes, it does. Like those huge, huge paintings, those massive paintings. Yes. Epic. Epic paintings of epic. But they keep coming, the angels keep coming, and there is clearly a finite number of these entities. And they're not angels. No. They're, they're light not. beings. They're light beings. Go, Go light beings. This is amazing. This is amazing. Go light beings. And some of them, like they're all clearly growing, but some of them look like little, like, these are not warriors. They were not they warriors. They were not, but they're stepping they're stepp up. I see like gardeners with rakes. I see them too. I see gardeners with rakes. All the people are just saying something needs to be done. I'm going to do something right. about it. I see what looks like cleaning ladies with mops. I see it. I see it. The cleaning crew. Hey, yeah. they're waving. Look. I've never seen this. It looked like space opened and they just went through like a portal, like a huge portal, yes. and then it went shoo. Yes, and there it's like gone. What happened? Seeing that big trial room? Yes. And it looks like the trees are testifying. Yes, I can hear them. They're coming up and telling their stories. Yes. It's like self-reporting. It's like the power of confession. Right. Just say it. Just say it. And then we can start to work forward. I thought this was going to be a way out for me, and so I made a deal with these dark entities, basically. Right. And then it started to go bad, and I didn't like it anymore. And what it looks but I felt like, trapped. right? What it looks like is they opened a door. They thought for one. They thought one. Right. And then it was like so many. It's um. I see them getting full really fast, and their lip, their cheeks bulging, bulging out. Bulging out, like I was seeing the same thing. Like yeah. as if they were full of bees. The story seems to be pretty much the same. If I thought there was just one. And they offered a deal that seemed good. They offered a deal that seemed good. I was looking for the easy way out. I had a dilemma. I was looking for an easy way out. This guy came along. He seemed like a good guy. I said, yeah. And then there were so many. What I just saw was them, the tribunal pulling out the contract that the trees signed, but the contracts are on paper. Yes. And they're saying, didn't you see these were on paper? Right. Right. Like that's it's on paper. It's like crazy. serving a chicken and egg for right. breakfast. Wow. That's pretty intense. That's pretty you intense. signed a paper contract. Wow. Wow. Well then, since we are fundamentally no different from trees, aren't we using paper right. products? Right. Wow. Wow. That's true. It's not okay to use paper products. It's not okay to ask other beings to meet our needs. Well then, I'm going to have to work over this whole toilet paper issue. <laughs> Not just that, paper. Paper. For recording purposes. Writing. How do we keep a record? Oral tradition. Feeling again like we're at that universe. There are more. It's like a... It's like a field of split open universes. I don't see any of them that look super healthy. In the end, does everyone wear white hats? As to be shown, in the end, how will these look? In the end, they all glow. Glow and have straight, perfect straight 
perfect high. grids. And they're perfectly balanced. Like and they hum Christmas and ornaments. Sing. Yeah. But like humming, humming, singing Christmas ornaments. Energy of the future. Bad.